Hi everyone, welcome. The surface of the moon. We get lines on the surface. There are lines on the surface of the moon that pass off for uh, lines in photos when they are not like this almost invisible faint bridge. You see, the smaller they are, um, very hard to see on the surface. But uh, again, I'm zooming in. I've done this before. I'm zooming in certain areas and we are seeing the proof. These lines that are on the surface are lines on the ground. As not impressive for some because you say, oh, wow, it's just a line. Yeah, well, that line was constructed and it's on the surface of the moon. It should not be there, especially where we are right here. The top left, I deliberately left in copper. Copernicus crater. God, I hate seeing that. It's Copernicus crater. You can see underneath all the pipes um, literally constructed objects. And look what almost looks like a bloody UFO here on the top there. Half into a mountainside there or crater like ca cavern object. Here, Rattlesnake's crater, this massive pipe in the bottom. Blue color here beside another pipe there. It is endless. Another darker pipe there that curves down. And by the way, goes all the way down there into Mare Eistrum. Um, the proof is there. This beautiful, beautiful greenery on the surface. And what looks like cloud cover. Again, the cloud cover or smoke that we're seeing on the surface of the moon, there virtually really is uh, a haze or smoke. But now here's the thing. When you're looking at the surface of the moon, people are seeing a gray surface. They're totally thrown off by the fact that there could be structures there. I mean, there are structures and there's some uh, through the entire surface of the moon. There's some on the bottom, north, east, uh, south, west, all over. And the proof, I've showed it many times. You know, these areas really do uh, remind me of trees. And of course, don't forget, we're looking through that haze all the time, right? And when we're looking through that haze, well, it leaves us the impression that there's nothing there. But now look here, all these connect objects just absolutely incredible looks like uh, gr the greenery could be over the structures or of course but one thing the beautiful colors we're seeing the atmosphere this is what's intriguing me the most John Lear was right he said there was an atmosphere up there possibly and I think possibly he is right changing the filters um, Certain colors, I guess, are better for certain kind of objects, depending on their, their reflectivity. That, that's the thing here. I've shown uh, um, not that long ago, Bianchini Crater right here. Look at the levels of the structure that's at the bottom of it. And look at these two black dots there that are at the top there. You know, there's, there's a um, similarity all over the moon when you get to the craters. You know, this crater looks constructed, literally. I'm not done zooming up on these UFOs, you know. I really want to get a good look at them. But, of course, even the military ones that were shown by the Pentagon themselves admitted, you know, are like this. You see the black dot, the black speck. Who cares? It's something that's on the surface of the moon. Ah, oh, bottom left, we just saw some there. And these were going, ah, oh, incredibly fast. That's the thing. The, oh, you see, zoomed up. I saw another one at the end there. Um, near the surface, guys, there are so many UFOs. And you know what? If they're not smaller, they sure are far away because they do look a lot smaller. Look, there's a UFO on the top here going by and there's a UFO on the bottom there going by. Here on Earth, we have launches, right? Even secret launches, but... Say to yourself, these are not uh, launches. These are everyday travel. They're traveling over the surface, probably at high speeds, you know. Uh, how would you like to live in Canada and work in Antarctica and be there in about 10 minutes?
It's all it takes for you to go to work in the morning and crossing the world in your craft. It's a reality. It's how it looks like and seems like they are living. These are real objects. A lot of stupid things, guys, okay? Um, some of you silly guys are saying about the frame rates are not following the video. I, the shit, I'm sorry, the shit that, that you guys come up with is stupid. And let, let's be serious, guys. I'm trying to show you guys what's on the surface of the moon. And on top of that, we're finding activity. We've found color. We're finding clouds now. It's never ending. And those who are here and supporting me and or just here because you're curious, you know, I respect that. You know, you're free to your opinion. Look at them, guys. They're going every which direction. We just saw them there in the bottom. There's activity. The closer we get, the more there are. There are smaller ones and closer ones to the surface. There are maybe even billions of people, hundreds of thousands of structures, and more to come. Thank you.